Hi guys, this is Farz and welcome to Farzalozi. And in this tutorial, I will show you how to edit and color grade a flower photo. So, let's get started. So, this is the picture I am gonna edit and it's a very beautiful picture. Okay, before editing, let me clear the concept first. So, this is a picture with a green background. And most of the time the background is green in case of flower photography and I prefer darkened background in case of flower photography because I want the full attention to the flower. And then the most important thing, don't lose the real color of your flower because the beauty of flower lies in its color. So don't lose the real color of your flower during the editing. So let's zoom into the color grading. So at first copy the layer by pressing Ctrl and J and then convert it to a smart object and then open it with camera or filter or you can edit this on Lightroom also just same setting okay let's come into the basic and here I am decreasing the expose a little bit I think minus 0 0.15 is good and decrease the highlight minus 35 is fine and then shadow and to bump up the shadows I think plus 61 is good and then I have to decrease the black I think minus 35 yeah it's good and then increase the clarity a little bit I think 5 for clarity and then I also increase the dehaze I think plus 10 is good and vibrance yeah, 17 for vibrance and then come into the curves and select the RGB here and click on this point and drag to the up. I think, yeah, this is fine and create another point. I think yeah this is fine and another point here this is fine and the last one I think it is fine so create a curves like this and then Come into the detail option and I'm to increase the sharpness a little bit I think plus 11 is fine and in case of noise reduction I think 10 is good just a little and into the color noise reduction I'm giving 33 I think 33 is fine okay then come into the color major and into the hue panel and for the green I am giving I think plus 50 is good it looks more green so this is fine and then minus 15 for aqua I think this is fine and then go to the saturation and I have to increase the red so 23 for saturation and decrease the orange just a little minus 8 and I have to decrease the yellow a little bit also I think minus 10 is fine and I have to decrease the green I think minus 63 is look good here and then minus 45 for aquas that's good and now come into the luminance and I'm giving minus 4 for red and plus 14 for orange 9 for yellow and minus 64 for green that's good and then minus 15 for aquas so I think this is fine it looks good now 
and then come into the effects option and I want to add a vignette look so I am giving minus 10 for vignetting option and come into the camera calibration option and into the rate panel I am giving 46 for hue and then 17 for saturation that's fine and into the green primary I'm giving 74 for hue and then minus 30 for saturation and the last one blue primary I'm giving just minus 2 for hue and 4 for blue primary so the color grading is done and now press Q to see the before and after here look at this look at the floor it looks more prominent now and the background more moody more darker so now press ok when you're done so let's say again before and after this was the before and this is after so look at the picture now all the attention to the floor i hope this tutorial will help you and i also give you this preset totally free so hit the like button for the preset and don't forget to subscribe